Hello, uh, my name is AntiHeroin13, and this is Skyrim Alternative Start. Um, last time, we sent the whole Dark Brotherhood to Whiterun, and we also changed the clothing on the Jarl Windhelm. And that was fun, because we changed his right-hand man to <laughs> some Imperial um, officer or something. That was great. Approach, my child. And choose where your new life shall begin. I got caught crossing the border. No. No. I don't want to do that. I want to escape this cell. So be it. Use the lockpicks. Were they there the whole time? What if I... What if I break them all? Are you gonna help me? I don't know. Only got three. And everyone knows how good I am at lockpicking. Oh no. <laughs> it's just like you break them. She's like, well, I can't help you because I can only I can only make three three of them appear at a time. Ta-da! Let's go see the the freaky ghost people. No! What charade what charade are you what charade are you talking about? Yeah, there's like living people. Eternal slumber awaits. Awaits you. Can I just punch you? Bar fight! Bar fight! Two against one, that's not fair. Someone live among the dead. You can never truly stop me. Oh, well, it would actually be better if I had like a shield or something. Or I could just freaking cheat. What's the insta kill? Haha! <laughs> Get wrecked by cheating. This is actually a really good idea. Do this. I wonder where I'm gonna end up. <clears throat> I didn't want to explore the rest of that. Cause I'm lazy. I didn't want to explore it. If uh if you guys seen my um uh the Forgotten City uh playthrough, um I have a tendency to I know I was cheating on that one and it was just because I wanted to learn the storyline, but I knew exactly where to go and that was weird. Like I didn't know that I wasn't supposed to go there yet and I already just walked through it and then I completed it in like eight videos, but I kinda feel bad because I was hoping to struggle more or something, so maybe I shouldn't have cheated, but, uh, oh well. Uh, there's no going back now. Um, I mean, I could replay it, I guess, I don't know. Uh, one, one other thing is, I did play, uh, the clock, or, 
I played the clockwork. <laughs> I played clockwork, the mod, and I didn't cheat on that one, so it did take me a while. But um, that was actually really rewarding because how creepy it was. So if you haven't seen it, uh, I would actually really recommend it. So I'd actually really recommend all of my videos. But um, let's see what else I have to say. Divines be praised, I've escaped. I suppose I will never know if that was really an avatar of Mara or not. But does it really matter? Time to take my way to er time to take my way to freedom. Well, I have it now, so Okay. Well that was that was fun. Yeah, I really enjoyed I really enjoyed clockwork. It was really good. I worked myself up at, at around the end and it wasn't it wasn't as creepy as it was in the beginning. I worked myself up and <laughs> I was like, "Oh no, she's going to get me." But approach my child and choose where your new life shall begin. I'm an outlaw in the wilds. A life of crime is still a life. Be wary, thief. Thief. Okay. Hello, are you my friend? Good morning. Good morning. Oh, good morning. Huh? Orders? This is crazy. The undead are everywhere. Need something? Are you talking to yourself, sir? I don't want to look up your skirt. Sorry. Oops. <laughs> I keep forgetting. The important stuff. No, no, it's not going to be one last time. That's not how addictions work. I'm a bandit. Do you want to be my friend? <gasps> You're a dark yes. elf. Be my friend. Need something? Yay. Now I got a dark elf buddy. Come on. I got a dark elf, but he's better than you. He's better than you as well. Well, if it's your kid, maybe you should give her some money. Or at least, uh, I don't know, help in some way. But if it's not yours, I don't care. I don't care either way. Like, I don't care about you, and I don't care about the woman that you might have a kid, w kid with, I don't know. Hey! Why are we mining? Aren't we bandits? <laughs> You're just named Bandit Thug. Okay, come on little Bandit Thug. How do I get out of here? Oh, I want to read that thing, I forgot. It's been too long since I've been on a good raid. No one in this place has the guts to rob a town or hijack a ca caravan or do anything useful anymore. Surprise, surprise. I can't stand it any longer. The life of crime is no longer profitable to me. Perhaps it's time I took up venturing instead. I doubt anyone here will miss me when, I've go when I'm gone. I just need to be careful not to get arrested by the guards in this hold. Jail would hardly be any good. Yeah, you keep keep walking. Oh wait, that's not the way out. I can make friends with the bandit thug. Wait, I have an idea. Sorry. Make you look cooler. Come here. No, get away from me. 
I thought that was a, like a live person for a second. Excuse me, sir. Let me step on your dead body. Is this how we get out every single day? We have to trudge through the water around dead bodies? We're not very good bandits. We should, like, we should, like, find someone's home with, like, a small family and then just make them disappear and then take their house. Come on, random friend. <laughs> it's so sad though, it's like, I spend some time with you and then um, I just decide to not let our friendship ever exist. Goodbye. <laughs> so that was pretty, uh, it's pretty cool. It's like the only bandits I'll ever bef befriend. Like, what happens if you did that and all the bandits were your friend? That'd be cool. Just kill them in their sleep then. Approach, my child, and choose where your new life shall begin. Oh no. I'm a village. or. diligent. of Stendar. Service to the divines shall bring you glory. <sighs> no. 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 I don't know why that was difficult for me to say. Some words are just weird. So my brain doesn't... I don't know. A second chance! Live another life. Hi. The suffering the Daedra cause will not go unpunished. We're eating Daedra hearts? <gasps> I'm hungry. It's not under food. Ooh. That was weird. <laughs> Hi. The mercy of Stendar does not extend to Why are you telling me this? I am one of you guys. You speak to a vigilant of Stendar. Cavort with any Daedra, and we will hunt you down. But I'm one of you, aren't I? Huh? I have finally been accepted in the vigilance of Stendar after today's trial of skill. Finally, after weeks of training and discipline, I can set forth on our mission to rid, rid the providence of Skyrim of the Daedra once and for all. That's going to be very difficult. If only those who... What? Me back home could see what I've done. Perhaps one day I'll have to surprise them with the news. I'm one of you guys. Now do what I say. The suffering... The what, the hell? Will be <laughs> what the hell was wrong with your face? I didn't like that. I didn't like it at all. I didn't like that. No. I don't like you. You know what I do to people I don't like? <laughs> the mercy of Stendar does walk all. Stendar it's like their you. face stops when you give them the orders. Suffering the Daedra cause will not you go unpunished. You know, there's a lot of Wherever Daedra, the right? Da there's a lot of Daedra, you know. Like Hermaeus Mora and Shia Gorath. Don't don't mess with Shia Gorath. I I know what that's like. The vigil will be watching. Does not to Daedra worshippers. <laughs> Shut up! I hate you all. <laughs> Whenever I see you guys on the road, I just want to kill you. And I usually do. Not because, like, oh, I... I think the Daedra are pretty cool. Honestly, I think they're pretty cool. I think they don't mess around and they do what they want. Like I do. So. Alright, I'm gonna leave you guys. I don't know why I keep pressing the wrong button. I'm gonna have to delete all these saves. <laughs> Just saves every time you have a new life. Begin your new life. Begin again. Approach, my child, and choose where your new life shall begin. I'm camping in the woods? 
Okay. The woods can be so peaceful this time of year. Good hunting. I'm not hunting, I'm camping. Happy camping. Happy camper. Begin again at Sierra Madre. <laughs> Have you guys ever played that DLC? It's freaking fun. I remember playing it on hardcore. And I did play it on hardcore. And I like beat it twice on hardcore. That was fun. That was one of the most difficult things ever. I mean, there's more difficult games, yeah. But it was difficult because like, there was this cloud that killed you constantly. And you had to constantly keep trying to heal yourself. And then there was like these ghost things that you tried to kill. and Whoa. This is my new life? Oh. <laughs> Apparently we go outside, there's Alduin. Bye. I actually followed him one time. I had no clip on and I was going really running really 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 fast and I got to him but I couldn't do anything about it. It's like rumbling outside. Must be fireworks because it's almost the 4th of July. Um, but, uh, yeah, I followed him one time, and I tried to punch him. <laughs> Actually did. Didn't do anything. I wanted to kill him right there to get it over with, but it wouldn't let me. Okay, so let's see what it says. I woke this morning to the sounds of battle and something terrible. A dragon. <laughs> Straight out of the legends of old. Helgen has been attacked and destroyed. Smoke and fire choke the skies over the town. The dragon flew off past Riverwood, going north. It seems safe enough to investigate. Nobody's ever going to believe this. Good, maybe you shouldn't tell them, because they'll think you're crazy. Well, that one was simple. Sometimes people just want a simple story, though. Just want to start out simple. And then, after I'm done with all this, I'll tell you which one was my favorite. Definitely not the Helgen one. Approach, my child, and choose where your new life shall begin. I was shipwrecked off the coast. Even in our darkest hour, there is yet hope. A lot of, like, I think in um, mythology, when they were talking about hope, like, I think in Greek mythology, it was like the last thing in Pandora's box. And sometimes I think that sometimes hope isn't good. <laughs> sometimes it just keeps you going. Let me drown first. I don't know. It was the last thing in Pandora's box, and I think it was supposed to be like a white moth or something. Did I just get knocked out and then here I am? doing this right. I'm supposed to get the frick out of here. Huh? Am I just stuck here for eternity now? Maybe I'm panicking because I'm in a shipwrecked. There we go. I had to spam the jump button. Yeah, Hope was supposed to be, like, one of the horrors, I think, <laughs> in Pandora's box. Like, whoa! Were you my friend? Did I know you? It's all my stuff now. Okay. How did I think that that was the way up? <laughs> Ugh, stupid. I have to go down to get back up. Duh. I don't like the- I don't like the thought of drowning. I don't- I, I- mean, I don't think there's anyone that's like, I like the thought of drowning. They're weird. They're weird if they think that. Get me out of here. Welcome to my new beginning, guys. My new beginning. 
and drowned. There must be some like door or something or a way out. There must be something. We went this way. <sighs> All the vegetables. I just want to see where I am. Like I want to see where I am outside. Just, did someone just tip over a boat? I don't, I've never seen this boat out in Skyrim before. Ow. I don't know how I hurt myself. I freaking get out. Huh? How do I get out of here? Help me. the way out. Well, it was pretty hard to find, so... Oh, it was actual boat. Hmm. Ta-da! Oh, are you a Thalmor? Lovely. Go, go die again. And hope the fish eat you. Okay, so that was that. Shipwrecked! That idiot captain rammed us right into an iceberg. That idiot. <laughs> then, while trying to free the ship, a rogue wave flipped us over. I should have listened to that old fat Bosmer <laughs> that said this ship was cursed. He was obviously right. It looks like everyone else. On this miserable tub is dead. I need to find a way to get out of here before the iceberg breaks loose and drags the ship down with me in it. I wonder if any of the equipment survived the wreck. I'm sure to need it soon. Yeah, I don't know if I grabbed any of it because I'm not going to really start. So uh, that's it for this episode. Um, I'm going. Hopefully I'll finish the rest of it in the next one. Um, but yeah, it's pretty interesting how you can start out... Uh, you know, new lives in Skyrim. I think there was another mod that I wanted to try too, but I can't remember. I think it was more for like role playing. I don't know. Uh, but this has been a, a new start to Skyrim, or alternative start. And my name is Anti Heroin Thirteen. And thanks for watching. <laughs>